Welcome back fellow tech enthusiasts! In this video I'm going to show you how engineering students water their plants when they are on vacation. A little warning at the beginning, this flower watering system might be over engineered but that's the whole point to it, isn't it? It all started with a 20 liter water canister. I simply drilled a hole into the front side at the bottom. The next step was screwing in an adapter for some silicon tubing. The gravitational water pressure will do the rest. In order to control the water flow, I put together a makeshift valve which squeezes down the tubing with the help of a lever, thus blocking the water flow. I used a broken servo motor modeled into a geared motor with stop switches at the lever's top and bottom position. An Arduino together with a motor controller board are the control unit. The Arduino makes sure the motor reaches the top and bottom and stops. I even embedded a security mechanism into the programming which shuts down the servo if it takes too long to reach the stop switches. Notice that at the lowest point the force caused by the squished tubing onto the motor is in a vertical line with the motor's axis, thus providing no lever and forming a self-jamming mechanism. That means the valve stays closed without having to power the geared motor continuously. After measuring the water flow rate, I calculated the two watering units consisting of a 17 seconds open valve and 550 milliliters of water should fulfill my sunflower's needs. For safety reasons, I didn't want the Arduino to stay on for longer than it needs to. With the help of a certified timer outlet, the Arduino is turned on for 20 minutes twice a day and then conducts one watering cycle consisting of 17 seconds of watering. I set everything up on my balcony and I'm happy with the results. What method would you have used for watering your plants? Now on the left you can find more projects on the right interesting how-tos and at the bottom you'll find my website. Press the button at the top to subscribe if you're interested in future over-engineered endeavors. Thanks for watching and as always keep doing it yourself.